Hi my friends, I have been knitting every morning now um, and I wanted to learn um, what I wanted to learn the reverse stocking stitch it says pearl fabric it says right here this pattern can be worked on any number of stitches let me show you first what it looks like in the book here um, it says on two needles first row the right side of work pearl all stitches it took me a while to learn the reverse stocking stitch I just couldn't figure it out and uh, I watched a couple YouTube videos about it and some of them said different things and did it differently than other people um let me show you this is the right side of work that's how i started what i figured out is uh the first row you do all pearls when the tail here is on the right side of the work then you do all pearls that's how you know that this is the right side first row right side of work pearl all stitches second row knit all stitches first row pearl all stitches second row knit all stitches see these last two rows form pattern and then it says it how to do it on four needles i'm using two needles right now on four needles pearl all stitches or simply use the wrong side of stocking stitch fabric let me show you again how to pearl all stitches well I'm just doing it I uh, showed it to you on another video I guess I could show you again um, once I'm at the end of the row and um, well the reverse um, stocking stitch is just pretty much the same as um, the way I always used to do it except I started um, you know when one side is pearl and the other side is knits um, except the right side used to I used to always um, use the knits and then I turn my work around there would be pearls on the other side well the reverse stocking uh, uh, the reverse stocking stitch would be on the right side of your work um, it would be pearls and then turn your work around would be knits on the other side do you know what I mean it would look like this and then the your uh, starting tail would be on this side um, that's how it would how I always knit it um, knits and then pearls but um, this time you start with knits and it's the same it's just reversed that's what I wanted to show you again that's how I started my work you see the pearls on this side and the knits are on the other side so let me show you again how to do the pearls I have other videos where I show you that and of course how to start your knitting and how to cast off your knitting so let me show you again slowly I always do the end stitch like this that's how I learned it let me show you again I I go in here can you see then I pull this thread around and pull it through and push on it like this and around you see how I put this thread in front of the needle put this needle in here 
twist around. Then I take this, my thumb, hold on to it, and pull it through. That's how I do the knit stitch. I'll do it again slowly for you. Okay, maybe a little bit from the side. Okay, I'll put the thread over it, put this needle behind this thread, come through here, hold on to this thread, pull it through, hold on to this thread again, and pull through. There you got it. I'll show you how to make the knit stitch too again. I knitted a few and I thought I could show you. So I turned the camera back on. I like the aluminum knitting needles. I don't like the bamboo ones or the plastic ones as much. So this is the right side of your work. These are pearls. Then you turn your work around and uh, I'll show you again how I do this. I go like this, then I put it around here and again. I think so. Yeah. Let me show you again how I do the knit stitches. I go back here. Let's see the camera has to be a bit sharper. Okay. I go back here. And then I pull the thread through the stitch. Like this. Then I go in here on the front and pull it through. I'll show you again slowly. I stitch in here, you see? Pull this thread here, I hold it here and pull it through. I kind of hold my finger here, stitch into the front part of it, you see? Get it through. I'll show you again a little bit more from the side. I love knitting. When I get in, up in the morning, I start knitting. And I pray. It helps me so much for the day. Do you see what it looks like? You only take this part. You see, not the back part. You only take this part. And then you pull it through, hold it here, and pull it through like this. That's how I learned how to knit. I learned how to knit when I was in Germany. I grew up in Germany. And at age 14, we learned how to knit and crochet and do some crafts. See? You can also hold it here if you feel like it and then pull it through. I just do it so fast, I don't always uh, hold it. Um, I guess I don't, um, but I always kind of push my middle finger here, go through it, you see? I don't always hold it here. I do it really fast. Yeah, I guess yeah, I don't always hold it. <laughs> I could just knit for the next half an hour. I actually started knitting again not too long ago. I had actually stopped. I was 
really busy making YouTube videos and moving I hope you enjoyed another instructional video from me on knitting the reverse stocking stitch I hope um, that I explained it good enough for you and showed it to you good enough have a nice day and have fun knitting till next time bye